everybody so i'm about to go to target um and i was supposed to get up er well i got up early today but not like too early but i'm already dressed i put i'm gonna put the get ready with me on tiktok so if you want to follow me on tiktok go do that now um but yeah i'm about to go on a target run someone gave me a 25 dollars gift card for christmas and i never used it so i'm about to go put it to use today probably won't be able to get nothing but a hot dog <laughs> but i just want to get out it's saturday it's cold outside but it's nice so i just want to get out and get some fresh air so i'm going to bring you guys along with me to figure out what i get um i'm probably going to organize my makeup like i said i was going to do last time just never did it um and then i'm going to um after I organize my makeup, I think I'm going to, I think I'm going to do like a small TikTok, I mean, not TikTok, please, a small Target haul so you guys can see what I picked up or whatever. So I will see you guys when I get to Target. Okay, so I'm on Target right now and of course I'm in the Ulta area and I don't really see anything that's like catching my eye. Um, yeah, I'm not really seeing much that's catching my eye. Maybe I'll go to like the self care area or something. Um, I don't want to take too long because someone's waiting on me, someone brought me here. So, um, I'm looking for like the next area, see what I can find, or like the um, Maybelline stuff. Let me see. Anastasia. No. Oh wait, it might be on this side. Hold on. It is on this side. Ooh, they got candles and stuff. I don't want to take too long, like I said. I think I know what I'm going to get. But then on the other hand, I don't. <laughs> Let me see. Um, they got Maybelline, but they don't even have my color. They got 380, but I'm 370. No. Absolutely not. They got 360. That's way too off. But yeah, nothing is really catching my eye. And I'm kind of upset because I didn't want to not leave for anything. Um, but yeah, I'm going to look around and then I'm going to come back to the vlog to show you guys what I got or what potential items I see. And then, yeah, I'm going to show you what I get. So after I left Target, I went to Publix and got their infamous crab dip. It's so good, 10 out of 10. All right, so I'm back home from Target and I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Um, I didn't really get much, but it's, I made myself happy by getting it. Um, I wanted to get makeup and stuff, but they didn't have anything. Like NYX was all out. Maybelline, I usually get their foundation cause that's my holy girl. They were all out. Um, I saw MAC and stuff, but of course they didn't have the dark skin girly tone. So I just got some skincare stuff. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Um, I only got three things and a snack, but it's still something, like I said, it still made me happy. So whatever. Okay, so this is what I got. I got this strawberry scrub, which smells so freaking good. I've never seen the strawberry one, which is crazy because I like strawberry. And then I got this little exfoliation thing. I've had one of these before. But I like to replace mine, so I got another one. And then I got some cotton rounds. Because I don't know if y'all saw, but in the last video, I was trying to use my rose water. But it's not the thing that sprays. It's like, I can't explain it, but I got these to go with it. So, that's what I got from Target with my gift card. And I'm so happy because I just like doing stuff for myself. So, yep, that's what we got. After I did my little haul, I had two teenage clients who wanted to get their makeup done for an event that they were going to. Um, these are real natural like faces because like I said, they are teenagers I don't want them to be looking like grown women because they aren't um, So I did a 
cute little natural beat on both of them um a little small strip lash something to give them a little lift on their eyes um blush i did bronzer i didn't do contour because like i said they're teenagers um and both of them had like a um, bold lip one of them had red lipstick and the other one had like a bright pink lipstick they both look so freaking cute okay so y'all have on my pajamas and today was a very eventful day um i'm saying eventful like i had stuff to do um i did two faces today which i'm really happy about and then i got a thousand forty four followers on tiktok which may not be a lot but <laughs> i'm very happy and i'm so happy that i am getting there slowly but surely um but i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog and i'll probably start up again tomorrow because this is going to be like a full weekend vlog of what i do this weekend so i'm going to start it over probably in the morning and yeah i'm about to go to sleep because i'm tired i'm about to take these lashes off this makeup off makeup <laughs> and i'm about to go to sleep okay good night Good morning, everybody. It's Sunday. It's a very nice Sunday, sunny outside. I literally just woke up, so like my voice is all raspy. Um, I don't really have anything to do today. I was supposed to organize my makeup so long ago, so that's what I'm probably gonna do today. Um, I'm about to go get me some breakfast and do my self-care routine because I feel like so dirty. Um, it's the last few days of my period, so I gotta, you know, get myself together. Um, my head scarf continues to come off at night, so <laughs> I don't know what to do at this point. As long as my hair ain't looking crazy, I don't care. Um, but yeah, I have to organize my makeup. I'm gonna take me a shower and stuff. I'm probably gonna do that first after I eat my breakfast. And then... Um, that's all I have for today. Um, honestly, I don't have anywhere to go today. I went to Target yesterday. Um, I'm probably just going to relax, write out some more content and things of that nature and just create a chill day for myself. Um, I watched a few movies and stuff last night, so maybe I can make today a productive day. Um, tomorrow, I think I have an interview somewhere, so I'm going to that. I don't have school tomorrow, considering it's a holiday, so... Um, I'm going to go ahead and take you guys to the kitchen with me. I truly don't feel like cooking anything. So I have two chicken melts in the microwave. And then I'm probably going to make myself some juice. Because like I said, I don't feel like cooking anything right now. Um, but yeah, I'm about to eat my breakfast. Y'all look at this little um, set I got from my Nana. It's so cute. It's like a little jacket and a gown. <sighs> so cute i have a blue one too i think i had it on in another video but it is so cute it's so comfy it's not hot at all like it's the perfect little set and i don't know where she got it she probably had this since i was born who knows <laughs> but yeah it's so comfort comfortable and it has like it's not long sleeve it's like a tank but this little coat just makes me feel so much warmer Okay, so this is my breakfast. I had two chicken melts. I ate one of them. And then I got two White Castles. And I'm watching one of my favorite YouTubers, Queen Chama. I love her so much. But, yeah, that's my breakfast right now. So, I'm about to enjoy it. And then I'm going to come back when I start my self-care routine. Okay, so now I'm about to take my shower. I'm in the bathroom already. I got my stuff in the shower already. I'm about to try to figure out how I'm going to tie this hair because it's really getting on my nerves. Every time I wake up, my head scarf is off. And um, this is synthetic hair. So what I do is usually put like a bow or something to tie and make sure the curls stay. But I'm going to try my best to wrap this scarf the correct way. Because every time I wake up, it just comes off. I think it's because of my head shape. Like, I don't know, man. It's so annoying. <laughs> But I'm about to go ahead and take my shower and then I'm going to come back after I, um, to start my skincare routine. Um, so you guys can see me do that. So I'll be back once my shower is complete.
I'm doing my skincare routine. We were clearly doing my favorite pajamas. This is a set I got from TJ Maxx, and I love them so much because it says self care and well, self love. I want some self care, <laughs> but yeah, and that's what I want to put into myself this year self love, self care, all that. But I'm about to do my skincare routine. It's pretty much the same stuff. The only thing different is I'm using my Derma Geek today. And I think last time I used my other Akira scrub, so I'm using a purple one today. And yeah, everything else is the same. I have my rose water, which I have, um, I bought cotton rounds for. Because for some reason, this sprayer is just, it's not like the misty spray. It's like, I, I can't explain it. But yeah, most of the stuff is the same, so I'm going to go ahead and let y'all watch me do my skincare routine. Now that I've started my skincare routine, I'm gonna tell you guys what I, um, I know when I start getting more subscribers, I know people are going to ask me, like, what's something that makes my page special? Um, I think it's more of what's something that makes my page different from everybody else's. Um, and it's because I'm teaching women to live in their authenticity um like my quote says it's an energy not an aesthetic it's all about the energy that you exude as a woman or as a person period um i don't think people are trans like and you can only be a trend for so long so now that we're on the rose water part the toner part I'm going to show y'all what I mean by this sprayer. Like, okay, so if I spray it on my face, look. It's not, like, misty. It's, like, the sprayer is really different. So, I finally settled and got some cotton rounds. And it makes it so much easier. Because it would get in my eyes and all the extra stuff. I'm just going to do it like this. Like this. Like this. Like this, like this, like this, like this. Okay. <laughs> this is why it, it takes me forever to get dressed for everything. Because I be playing. Like, girl, we got stuff to do. Well, I don't have nothing to do today, but y'all get the gist. All right, and then I'm going to take my glycolic. I think this is the only thing that's been helping my breakouts honestly so I'm just gonna use this all right and then I'm going to finish my skincare routine I'm gonna brush my teeth and then I'm going to I think I'm going to organize my makeup right after so so yeah back to what I was saying I feel like putting yourself in an aesthetic or in a niche kind of pulls you away from being yourself authentically as well as you start to overexert yourself and I don't want to do that to myself like at all I'm creating content that feels special to me that I want to feel special to other people and that's just the bottom line like I just want to create content that's authentic content that other hood bitches can you know relate to that's all Okay, so this is all the makeup I got. Um, I got random lashes everywhere. This box is broken. This is trash. So let me toss this in the trash. And then I'm going to get to organize it. I'm trying to make a TikTok video as I film this. So let's hope and pray that works. <laughs> okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is take everything out this little thing here. I'm doing this on my bed because I just feel like it's more efficient in a way. Yeah, I have all types of things. This is this stuff is really for like my clients and stuff, but I am kind of going through a rebrand with myself and my businesses. So I got all types of stuff like sponges and stuff. These for like um, if you want your eyebrows arched and things of that nature. Um, I don't even know where this came from. <laughs> blush palettes and this came out of something that I got from Shein a while ago and I still haven't threw it away. I have my rhinestones that I need to organize because they are not organized anymore. Like all of them are all mixed together. 
got clips for my clients that I never opened. Um, and brush, brush cleaner that I'm about to use because these brushes are filthy. And I have this brush cleaner, which I'm actually probably going to throw away because it's too much makeup on it. And it seems like it catches germs a lot, so I'm going to just toss it. But I finally got this out. It's one pair of random lashes in there, but I got to clean this out. I'm going to go clean this out really quick, and then I'm going to come back. Okay, so now that's all done. I got this box from Dollar Tree. I don't know what I'm going to put in it, but I want to organize this some type of way. I don't know if I'm going to cut the lashes, like the lash things up and put them in here. Or if I'm going to put palettes in here. I'm not sure, but I am going to use it because this is ridiculous. I have way too much makeup and it should not be looking like this. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and put this. I think I'm going to put this in here. And then I feel like I want my brushes to go in there as well. Um, I'm going to wash them in a second. Something just dropped. I don't know what that was. So yeah, I'm going to put my brushes in there. So I have this like BH Cosmetics thing. I'm putting all of my disposable. I don't even know why this is in there. But I'm putting all of my disposables in there. Like the lip gloss applicators, little brushes and things like that. Um, and these, of course, just so I can have a safe space for them to go. So let me do that. Okay, I think next I want to start with the makeup wipes. I think I'm going to put them in this corner. Because um, I have a tons of them. As you can see, there's one box here, one box in my hand, one, two packages here. So yeah, I think I'm going to put them over here. And then that little container that I said I put all the, the disposals in, I'm just going to put it over here to the side. And then I have my micellar water and then my brush cleaner. I'm just going to put it right here in the middle. Okay, so that's it for this one. Now that this is somewhat organized, I'm going to go ahead and start with the other stuff. Like I said, I still got all this stuff here. I don't know what I'm going to do with these palettes and things. I have to figure it out, but it looks a hot mess. Okay, so I decided that my makeup palettes can fit on this side in this little corner here. But these are my Beats by Dead palettes, like the perfect palettes for any occasion. I have the nude one, and then I also have the color one. So these are the, my two holy grails as of right now. So I'm going to go ahead and put these in this corner that's right here, just so I can be a little bit more organized. Okay, so now I'm about to go take this where it belongs, and then I'm going to come back and do the rest. This is a makeup kit that I got from school, which I need to wash the brushes that are in here as well. But um, I'm just going to put this with that stuff because it's pretty much already organized. So let me go walk this in there. So I got this lash book from Murphy like a long time ago. And all of my lashes are supposed to go in here. But as you can see, I just take them off and throw them anywhere. Um, so I'm about to go ahead and put them in here because I don't know what I'll be doing. <laughs> So, yeah, I don't even know which one matches, which one doesn't. So, I'm about to go through them and try to figure out which ones I want, which ones I don't, and all that jazz. Okay, this looks so much better. I don't know what I was doing. I don't know what I've been doing. But, I guess these will be the lashes that I'll be wearing for this month. These are more like festivity, festivity lashes. So, I probably won't wear these as much as I used to. But, yeah, these will be the lashes for this month or well, for the rest of this month. And then... I will change them up as I feel like it. Okay, so now I have like glitters, rhinestones, and lashes left. I feel like I want to cut all of the lashes up and put them in that box. But I also want the glitters and stuff to go in that box. Hmm. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know what I'm going to do. Um, what y'all think I should do? I feel like... It won't be enough. I think I'm going to put all of this stuff in that bag over there. And then put the lashes in that box. I don't know yet. I'm about to figure it out. So I'm pretty much tired of seeing lashes everywhere. So what I'm doing is just cutting them into a subsection. So I can put them in this box that I showed you. Um, I'm about to cut this box in subsections. Because honestly, it's just taking up too much space. And... I'm really just tired of seeing stuff thrown everywhere. So, I got these lashes from Shein. 
and I'm about to just cut them up into subsections. I'm gonna be very careful that I, that I don't um, tear them up, but I'm just gonna take my scissors and I'm probably gonna cut them into like fours maybe. So like, I think I'm gonna go up here. These scissors are so dull. And then I'm gonna cut it in half. So I'm gonna show you guys what the finished product product looks like once I'm done cutting them up so I can make sure I take my time with this because I don't want to cut a lash. Okay, so now that I've cut them all in subsections, my life is so much easier. I mean, there's some that are still like in the box, but other than that, most of them are in subsections. And when I do clients, I'm gonna just have them pick out the ones that they want. And I have a lot more room in this bucket. So now that everything is pretty much done, all this other stuff is trash, which I'm going to toss. This one, I can't find the other one too, so it's garbage. But everything is pretty much done. I'm about to put the top on it and show you guys what it looks like in the area that it's in. Okay, so this is what it looked like when my makeup is supposed to be organized. These are all of my lip pencils and like tweezers and things. Lashes, glitters, blushes, contour. The makeup kit that I got from school and then brushes, more makeup, palettes, um, brush cleaner, micellar water and disposables and wipes. So yeah, it's all organized and I'm so happy because it looked a hot mess. Okay, so now that I've organized all of my makeup, I think I'm going to end the vlog here because I have a few things that I'm going to do as far as like productivity. I have to create, I have to write down the content that I'm going to do next week. Um, and I have to, like I said, I do have an interview tomorrow, so I got to get ready for that. And I do want to enjoy the rest of my Sunday, maybe watch TV and chillax a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog. I hope you guys had a great weekend as much as I did. Um, it's very sunny out. It was sunny yesterday. So I hope you guys go out and enjoy the fresh, sunny air. It is cold outside. So please put on a coat, jacket, earmuffs, all that good stuff. But yeah, I'm going to end the vlog here. And I hope you guys have a great weekend. I love you guys. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.